Into the final bend of the track in the US presidential race, and the rivals are cramming in as many marginal states as possible over the weekend. Each used humor on Saturday to attack their rival. Barack Obama, who began the day in Ohio, has said Tuesday's vote is about two different visions of America. Governor Romney, he's a very talented salesman. So in this campaign, he has tried as hard as he can to repackage the same policies that didn't work and offer them up as change. But, you know, here's the problem, Ohio. We know what change looks like and what he's offering ain't it. The Republican candidate began in New Hampshire as he tried to hammer home his message of lower taxes and a large cut in the federal budget. After describing the latest jobs report as evidence that the economy's at a standstill, he's appealed to people to vote for love of country. I need you to spend some time in the next three days to see neighbors and uh, maybe ones with an Obama sign in front of their home and just go by and say, look, uh, let's talk this through a bit because you see, See, President Obama came into office with so many promises that he's fallen so far short. One opinion poll released on Saturday puts Romney one percentage point behind Obama, meaning they're virtually neck and neck given the margin for error. The Republican needs to win a majority of the key swing states.